Welcome to Beth Page Federal Credit Union Stadium in the Durrell Bronco Pearsall Field on NEC Front Row. My name is Nick Matina. Joined alongside me to my left is Anthony Cabaretta for this NEC conference matchup between the LIU Sharks and the Seahawks of Wagner College. Ten seconds left on the possession clock for the Seahawks. Coming in front with a quick shot and a goal for the Seahawks. And it's Vanneman who opens the scoring here. But coming right into the second quarter as Wagner wins that faceoff and they go back on the attack, continuously doing what they did in that first quarter, and that is run around LIU, trying to get them flat-footed. Dwyer rips a shot over the shoulder of Mark, and the Seahawks, just like that, go up 2 to nothing. just 48 seconds in to this second quarter. Trying to make his way now towards the net, passing in front. A quick shot and a save as Russell tries to get it, but the rebound goes in. Have to fight off the Seahawks once again. Holding now is Kaminsky with a shot and a goal. Dylan Kaminsky, the senior, finds the back of the net past Mark and regains that two goal lead for the Seahawks. Holding and waiting, the shot by Garb. They make it there and a bounce shot is put in. Anna. And Akana holding. Goes around the net, back up to the top of the box. It's Garb. Garb spinning off his defender, waits, looks, shoots, and scores. Jake Garb. With a shot from the high slot, beats Mark top shelf. And Wagner extends their lead. As Jake Murphy trying to make some moves, and a pass in front, and it goes in. Jake Gillis with his first goal of the season for LIU. Makes this a three-goal lead for Wagner once again who finished with 47 goals and 19 assists. And another goal there by LIU. And on the goal, it will be Richie LaCalandra with his second point of the afternoon, had an assist, and now adds a goal. His first collegiate goal for Richie LaCalandra. Nice dodge by Murphy, trying to cut in the middle. Murphy to his left. Finds Valari. Valari, dodge. Valari looks, shoots, and scores through the legs of Brady. And we're back within one. And a great shot there by Valeri as he was able to get it through the legs. Doing a nice down low shot as he had one defender on him, but he was able to get the shot off. And they are celebrating wildly on at the sideline for LIU. And now back to even strength. Shot there and a goal. Tyler Lawton rips one from to the right of Mark. And it looks like Mark might have been blind there with two defenders in front of him. And Wagner College extends their lead once again. And now a 6-4 to four lead for Wagner College over LIU. And another one finds the back of the net. This time... It's Steven Dwyer. Looks like Wagner's first penalty on the day. Grosso with pass in front, finds Murphy who shoots and scores. See, Alex Russell, excuse me. Alex Russell popped up right in front of the high slot and just wrapped it right around Brady for LIU's fifth goal of the afternoon as they still trail seven to five. Villari. One-on-one -on -one defender. Valari trying to cut in front. Valari has some room. He looks up, shoots, and scores. Dylan Valari beats Brady between his legs and brings it back to a one-goal game as Wagner now leading 7-6 to six with 9-10 remaining in the fourth quarter. Russell with the ball now for LIU in the left alley. Makes his way into the box. Finds Snelder. Snelder's with a pass in front to Gillis, who's wide open, and this game is tied. Jake Gillis with his second goal of the afternoon. And the Sharks have made their way back and tied this game at seven. And you can tell the anger of head coach Bill McCutcheon yelling at his defense right now, asking where did this game go? As the Sharks back in this one, looking to take the lead for the first time this afternoon. And Late also in this afternoon with a minute and a half remaining in regulation. LaCalandra comes out front, shoots and scores! LaCalandra with the goal to take the lead. And looks like we might 
have a little bit of confusion there, but they do call the good goal. They were trying to see if there was a crease violation, but La Calandra with a Superman dive, putting the ball around Brady. And Anthony, LIU takes the lead for the first time this afternoon. And trying to bully his way through is Dwyer, who shoots and scores. Dwyer ties the game for Wagner with 20.7 remaining, and the bench erupts. Dwyer with a one-man band, just took it right in front and beat Mark wide. Finds Dwyer, being double teamed. Try Dwyer cut out front, it hit the post. And they're gonna call the good goal. Wagner College storms into LIU. Thank you for joining us this afternoon on NEC Front Row, where you've been watching LIU Sharks men's lacrosse here on NEC Front Row.